Hi everyone! Um, in this video I'm going to be talking about the Real Techniques Core cool Collection by Samantha Chapman. Uh, there she is, looking gorgeous. Um, these brushes were $21.99 from Boots.com. Um, I had, I meant to get some from the Boots store where I, well, near to where I work yesterday, but I lost my Boots card and my Advantage card and I had like 100, well, almost £100 worth of points on my card and I wanted to use my points to buy them because that's what I'd been saving them for. So, um, yeah, they, they came this morning lo along with, I also got like a delivery from Mac, which is like the best thing ever, like a load of makeup being delivered. Yeah, this is what the brush set looks like, and in this you get, um, this one is called a buffing brush, and the thing that I didn't realise about the buffing brush, and I've seen um, Sam and Nick use these on Pixie Woo, is it's actually quite square, which I really like, because you can kind of like really, I don't know, work like contour maybe a bit easier with that, so I'm going to have a go with that. Um, I also like that they stand up, she says, this table isn't... Um, it's not completely level, it kind of goes up at the corners, it's a children's table from Ikea. So yeah, um, and then the other ones, um, this is called like a detailer brush and basically um, you'd use that anywhere on the face where you needed to get like real precision. So that's a really, really nice one. And then you get like a pointed foundation brush and Compared to like a MAC brush, it's like half the size, and I kind of like that because you can get under the eyes a, a bit better. Um, so yeah, again, it's like duo uh, fibre bristles, like cruelty free. And then we have the final one, which is like probably my favourite in this collection, and this is the contour brush. Um, I have the MAC contour brush brushes, and I find that because they're goat hair, they kind of like lose their shape really quickly. Um, to the point where I have to kind of like constantly reshape them after I've cleaned them. I clean my brushes like all the time, so it's really important for me that they keep their shape. So um, I'm hoping that this one will do the job. Um, it'll be really nice to kind of get into the contour and you know use that for that, if that makes sense. So yeah, that's the four brushes. They also do another one, and I think it's called a multitask brush that has the same colour, I think. Um, I'm also hoping to pick that up, so um, yeah, I hope that was useful. They are really, really good brushes because I've already had the stippling brush, which I repurchased because I find that I like to use this for foundation, and sometimes if I've used it on foundation... And then I think, well, actually, I want to apply some cream blush, and it, or, it and it's already got product in there. Um, it's a bit, it's kind of like sometimes the product can kind of like go where I don't want it to. So it's always good to have like a few different clean brushes to work with. So yeah, I already have used the Samantha Chapman Real Techniques brushes. It's not just that I've thought, oh, I'll make a video before I've used them. I've already started using them. So yeah, uh, I hope that was useful. And um, I'm going to be reviewing the um, Your Eyes kit next. So if you want to watch that, um, subscribe and click on my little face, I think it is, and or my name, and you'll see it on there. Okay, I'll see you in a second. Bye.